Hey guys, it's Dahlia, the intern here at Her Interactive. This week we're going to be talking about something I've always wanted to know. How to dress like Nancy Drew. Now obviously Nancy has a lot of different environments and situations. And I mean you wouldn't wear the same thing to River Heights as you would to New Zealand, right? But generally, Nancy keeps her style the same no matter where she goes. So in this video, I'm going to show you two different simple outfits that you can make at home or find at a thrift store so that you too can be just like Nancy Drew. Just in case you want to do, you know, your own sleuthing or something. So without further ado, here is how to dress like Nancy Drew. This first outfit is inspired by classic Nancy, something I personally think she would wear in Cairo or New Zealand. A simple button-down dress that's lightweight and, more importantly, easy to snoop in. The best thing about these dresses is that they have a lot of pockets. Perfect for hiding keys you're not supposed to have. Now, of course, the most important thing to keep in mind when dressing like Nancy Drew is whatever she's wearing has to be movable, including her shoes. I mean, when I explore bogs, I try not to wear heels. Mostly because I don't want to get stuck. Because if I saw Fiona Malloy coming at me, I would want to run as fast as I could. And that's why it's perfect for Nancy to be wearing black flats. Or penny loafers if you have them. The second Nancy outfit is based on something I think Nancy would rock in her hometown. It's a plaid or argyle piece that makes this outfit a little preppier. Which is a look Nancy always went for, even before it was cool. Pair that with a short sleeve polo that's easy to move in and a little button down sweater in case you get cold and bam! It's an awesome Nancy outfit made of things you may already have in your closet. The number one thing you need to have with you when you're Nancy is obviously your magnifying glass. No outfit is complete without it and you can't spot tiny clues or read between the lines if you don't have it with you. Whenever you see her magnifying glass there's no need to worry cause you know Nancy's on the case. It's a great outfit for everyday sleuthing, not too conspicuous. That is, until you pull out your notebook in the middle of a conversation. Nancy's notebook is one of the most essential pieces of her sleuthing. You never want to forget a clue. And that's why she's always got her notebook on her and ready to reference whenever it's time to solve puzzles or mysteries. And that is how you can become Nancy Drew. Well, besides playing the games. Now you're a real life detective. Like I mentioned before, anything you saw in this video I found either at a thrift store or a secondhand store. So really, anybody that wants to can do a little sleuthing in those stores and find their own Nancy Drew outfit. And who knows, maybe after you collect your outfit, you can find an old mansion to investigate. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to leave any questions or comments you have down below and I'll check them out. Also, if you have any videos you want to see me make, Leave them in the comments down below. I want to hear your ideas. Maybe you want to know how to dress like another character from the game. Anyways, I hope you guys have an awesome day, and I will see you next Friday.